Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm here with another very useful and informative video. In this video, I'll show you how you can fix this type of error if you are trying to browse anything on Safari browser and you are facing the problem. Safari cannot open the page because it could not establish a secure connection to the server. So if you are having this type of problem on your iPhone device while using the Safari browser, then in this video I'll show you how you can fix this type of problem on your iPhone or iPad device. So now let's get started how you can fix this problem. First of all here you'll have to open Safari browser and then from here you'll have to close all the open tabs on Safari browser. You'll have to close all the open tabs on Safari browser. Then after that here you'll have to close all the other tabs. Then after that here need to open setting. Then after that here make sure that your internet connection is strong and if you're using Wi-Fi then you will have to disconnect with Wi-Fi and connect it again and if you're using mobile phone data then you will have to turn off your mobile data and turn it on again. Then after that here you will have to scroll it below tab on general. Then here again scroll it below then tab on date and time and here make sure that your iPhone or iPad date and time is correct and the set automatically is selected from here. Then after that here you will have to close this tab. Then here again open setting of your iPhone device. Then again scroll it below tab on general. Then tab on software update. And here make sure that you are using an updated version of iOS. If you don't have an updated version of iOS, then you will have to update your iPhone device to the latest version. Then after that here, you will have to again open setting. Then here scroll it below. Then here search for Safari browser. So here is Safari, you will have to just simply tap on this. Then after that here, you will need to scroll it below. So here tab on clear history and website data, then here you'll have to select the all history, then here turn on the toggle choose all tabs, then after that tab on clear history, then after clearing the history you will need to scroll it below, then tab on advanced, then after that here tab on website data, and from here you'll have to delete all the available website data here, then after that check that the problem fixed or not. If the problem is still there, then we'll need to again open setting. Then here scroll it below tab on general then tab on VPN and device management and here make sure that you are not connected with any VPN if you are connected with VPN then you will have to disconnect with VPN and then try again later and check that the problem fixed or not if you are having still this problem then you will have to again open setting then tab on general then here scroll it below here tab on transfer or reset iPhone then here tab on reset then tab on reset all settings then after that here you will need to enter your iPhone passcode and after that hopefully after all these settings your problem will be fixed and the Safari browsing problem will be resolved so this is the way through which you can fix this problem so that's it from this video hopefully you like this video if you like this video then please subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon so that you can get my all upcoming videos thank you very much for watching this video